Hello everyone. Good morning or good afternoon or maybe good evening. Uh, to depend when you leave. Welcome to my uh, third uh, live stream, I think, three or four, I don't remember. Um, yes, welcome uh, in a wonderful uh, school from uh, Holland, uh, the Boerma Institute, with a lovely uh, friend, Mike, Angelica, Jacqueline, of course. Then. <laughs> yes, um, welcome for um, the new live stream. I uh, introduce uh, a new uh, design today, three design. Um, I focus today um, with uh, the first design with a mechanic uh, bouquet, anti bouquet. For me, it's a new technique, but it's very uh, interesting because uh, we can make uh, um, a lot of ID, a lot of um, concept, shape, uh, everything. Uh, the second design, the we, we can uh, see um, the self uh, uh, supporting the self-supporting uh, with a very big pieces. I uh, show uh, these uh, pieces uh, in January in uh, SN for the trade show. Uh, and I explain again, uh, because I love the texture, you remember. Uh, I explain uh, uh, um, uh, a twist technique and the uh, very interesting texture with the clay. And the last design, it is a, a displacement, uh, but a very different displacement uh, and uh, with only a plant, not only plant, just a little bit uh, uh, cut flower and plant, because for me the plant it is a future. So we can uh, start with a uh, bouquet. Okay, thank you. So, very long bouquet. Of course, we can uh, uh, make uh, um, a small shape. Huh? But uh, for, um, for the live stream, I prefer uh, show you a very um, big pieces. I think it's better in a live, in a video. Um, the mechanic bouquet, uh, we uh, use always a wire, black wire, very strong wire. The minimum it is a 1.8 or 1.6. And uh, uh, we, uh, we make uh, uh, a fit. I don't know if you see, yes, like this is better with my white shirt. Uh, we make always uh, uh, a fit like this with the spider technique, you, you know, but very small spider technique. It's not necessary a lot because just for uh, fix the, um, the fit for no move during uh, you flowering the, the anti-bouquet. And uh, always uh, we have uh, a support uh, sometimes it is a branch, sometimes it is a structure, sometimes it is a wire. But we have a lot of solution, a lot, a lot, a lot. I teach uh, this um, concept uh, yesterday and uh, I think and I hope the student is happy with this technique. And, um, and for my opinion, uh, it is a very commercial also uh, concept um, because it is uh, um, very easy after for flowering. We no uh, need to take the bouquet uh, in you. Yes, of course we use the uh, end, uh, but it's not necessary to um, take the bouquet like this and cut after, very traditional technique. No, you can see now 
I use uh, uh, my structure because the structure helped me a lot during the flowering. So I start uh, when I start always uh, um, I put the, the very strong material uh, and the strong material give me a character and uh, uh, sometimes a character, sometimes a line uh, in the bouquet. And after, when uh, uh, I continue, I uh, uh, I use always uh, um, yes, always no, often, often the decorative style. But it's no necessary with uh, this uh, concept uh, a focus with the shape because. When you uh, make a traditional bouquet, uh, of course, you use a lot of green leaves for um, block the flower, for constructing your bouquet. For this one, it's not necessary. I use a little bit green leaf just for uh, give a life. But uh, um, uh, I uh, use my uh, structure for help me uh, because always when we uh, make, uh, when we decided a shape or the ID, it's uh, very important um, to have a, a small space, small uh, empty space for uh, um, uh, block my flower. And yes, I explained just uh, before, when you uh, make a, a traditional bouquet, you uh, focus um, with a uh, um, round shape or square shape or triangular shape. But for this bouquet, it's not necessary because the shape, it is a structure. So. I start always there with a very big flower. And ah yes, it is very different with the traditional bouquet. We need to cut the flower before when you um, flowering. You can make the bouquet like this, okay, and cut uh, when you end. No, it's impossible. The structure, um, um, my structure uh, help me when I start and when I have I finish my bouquet. So. Uh, I uh, no explain, uh, uh, no explain, no uh, talk a lot. Huh? Uh, you can enjoy also. And uh, watch me, watch the, the wonderful bouquet. And watch the amazing flower also, because I have the Amazing uh, peony, coral peony. I combine it also with uh, um, coral dahlia. I think the color is interesting. And the color uh, prepare for the Sprite, spring, sorry. Yes, my English is always bad. Huh? A little bit better, but uh, my pronunciation is uh, always terrible.
In the, the mechanic bouquet, we need uh, um, always, um, when you're flowering also, uh, always um, obtain a different level because the structure is always very masculine and we need, uh, um, uh, when you uh, use the flower material, we need a, a little bit feminine work. But it's very easy. I no necessary uh, um, take my uh, tie very strong, like uh, a traditional bouquet. I know so far, never with this technique. It is for the lazy florist or for the old florist. We have just a problem. The table is too small, like me. Yes. Yeah. I know anticipate the table, Mike. The, the size of the table. Yeah. You don't remember? I am a small, but I make always a very big design. Yes, and the contrast always with this um, concept, the structure, it is always very, I explained just before, very masculine, mechanic, um, strong. And when we flowering, you have a, a very contrast because you uh, give a little bit poetic work. And just uh, uh, when I finish my uh, flower uh, dancing um, between the, the structure. Also, um, the task important, the point important. Um, Sometimes uh, I have the, a spiral in the back. Sometimes it is a, a very uh, the, my uh, stems is very vertical, and sometimes I crisscross. To depend. But the um, theory with the proportion with the stems is very, very, very different in the traditional bouquet. Because when you learn the traditional bouquet, always we explain um, the proportion um, between the uh, flower, the tie, and the, um, and the stems. You remember, we have two per three and one per three with the stems. But here, absolutely no. I cut very short the flower. And uh, of course, I don't have the, the proportion. But when the work is finished, it is always aesthetic. It is a... Uh, uh, I don't know if it is um, uh, a good result. And uh, uh, when we uh, teach the proportion for the traditional bouquet, I don't know if it is uh, the reality. But when uh, we uh, see the uh, final, the result is very, very aesthetic. And, of course, I know respect the proportion, the traditional proportion. Of course, when we, um, we have a long bouquet like this, we need uh, uh, sometimes a little bit uh, a, um, uh, 
obtain a little bit uh, flower or leaf in a, in a top for uh, obtain a good uh, harmony. You understand it's okay? If you don't understand, uh, you stop me. Uh. No problem. Uh. No necessary to polite. Uh. How many people we have, Angelica, today? Uh, right now, I think 24. And okay. uh, we have uh, some people in our chat who are saying hello to you. We Good. have uh, Taiwan, that is uh, the school we work together. Oh, Taiwan! <laughs> and we have Roxanne Rurich in the chat saying hello from Michigan, USA. Hello, hello. How many? You, you don't, don't remember? 20? 24. 24. Okay. No 150? Uh, not yet. <laughs> ah, not yet. Ah, because the last time huh, in Taiwan, I have a lot of uh, students. I like this. So um, I uh, use also a dry material sometime for uh, obtain the uh, visual uh, point. And uh, um, for connect also with the color with my uh, structure. And what is the dry material? It is a uh, um, banksia. You see the banksia um, for the next. Uh, I have here for the next uh, design. I use a banksia. It is this one, okay. But when is uh, a did? Uh, you have the fruit, and uh, after is dry, and we have this color. It is very very interesting material. But uh, we uh, need to uh, take out everything for uh, see the uh, fruit in the stem. stem. So Roxanne Rurich says, I am absolutely loving this design. Thank you so much. But the color, huh? it is beautiful. Uh, it is very beautiful and uh, very strong impact. And we have uh, uh, a very good, good feeling. Oh, yes, you feel the stems. The stems, oh, um, it's interesting. And you can see all my stems. It's the same size for drink uh, in a plate because we use always a plate for this concept. For me, it's also interesting because uh, um, when you sell a bouquet, always a customer uh, lose, um, change the water, lose, uh, cut uh, um, the stems. And after the durability is bad. But for this concept, you use a plate, you have just a little bit water. And uh, um, of course, the, the people can see um, in a plate uh, um, they don't have enough water. And he, um, 
I don't know in English. Rajouter. Uh, okay, don't worry. I have my boyfriend. Is it to refill? To refill the water very easy? I don't know. Y oh, yes, yes, yes. But uh, um, one second. Look, my boyfriend is Google Translate. He's very nice. He's so nice. Oh, yes, had. Hey, D, D. No H. Hey. Uh, yeah. Had. Yes, had. Sorry, I check again. Yes. Uh, um, the uh, customer, um, when he sees the plate, and if uh, we, um, if they don't enough water, he had water. And no necessary change the water. Because you have a little, little, little bit water, it's enough for the flower. But we need a hard every day um, in a plate. And no necessary, we don't have a bacteria. And always the same question. It is, but uh, uh, okay, it's interesting concept, but uh, for the packaging or for uh, sell the bouquet, it's not easy. Of course, it's easy. When you sell uh, a composition with a oasis form, it's the same for the packaging. Of course, this one is very big bouquet. But yesterday, I uh, uh, make a, a, a very small bouquet, or sometimes very, uh, not very, but tall, but not large. It's very commercial. You know you use a lot of uh, flour, and uh, uh, also it's, uh, um, it's good because we have always a flour broken when you receive the flour. And always the, 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 the flower broken we use in the small composition, but you can use for this uh, a bouquet. Okay. I hope you like. So and with a wonderful plate. So Taiwan says amazing and special bouquet. Yes, very special, but I think it is a good concept. And, and uh, uh, I continue um, to check a, a solution for this bouquet. But uh, yes, for me, it's very, very interesting bouquet. Yes. We okay. also uh, have I, more Dudea. Uh, in I the go chat? back just for you. Enjoy the, <laughs> the shape and the, the color. Yeah. Sorry, Angelica. So we have Morbidea in the chat. She uh, says, uh, good afternoon from Aris Hochschool or High School. Uh, thank you for demonstrating today. You're welcome. And we have Shiwa Daruma saying, loving this bouquet, so beautiful. Thank you, thank you. And also, uh, just for end, uh, um, the shape, uh, of course, I use this for this one, for this bouquet. But uh, you can use the shape also for other decoration. No necessary uh, this construction for anti bouquet. You can use maybe for um, a door decoration, but with oasis or with a tube, plastic tube or glass tube. Yes, like this. Sorry. I don't know if you see correctly. That yes. is also very nice. Yes, it's very nice uh, shape for wall decor or for um, door decoration. Yeah. Okay, I give you. Thank you so much. Be careful, you wonderful plate. Mike, can you put it in the car? We can bring it home. <laughs> Okay, so the next um, design, it is a self, uh, I don't remember again, the self-supporting, oh, because uh, 
I explain always self-blocking, but it's not good word. Self-supporting uh, is better. Okay. So for this one, uh, um, I uh, use a lot of wire. Um, and I use a twist technique. Of course, it's very long work because the pieces is big, but you can make small pieces also. Uh, the twist technique uh, we have uh, for me four um, different uh, um, technique. The twist technique it is like a chicken wire. But this one, it is very asymmetrical chicken wire. And for me, it's better because uh, it's more natural, more organic, and you can um, construct it um, organic shape. Because if you use uh, 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 the traditional chicken wire, you can make uh, um, a very nice uh, shape. Um, always it is, um, you have a hunker and it is always very destroyed and for me it's not aesthetic. Um, we need uh, uh, a different uh, uh, space also. Uh, it's more natural. So it is the um, first technique. After you have the other te twist technique with, um, um, again, a wire, of course, but for focus in uh, general rework, it's more regular. Uh, I, uh, uh, I have a different example in my Instagram page. Uh, you have also the the technique, uh, the twist technique for the hand tie bouquet. When you start, you have uh, the small flower. I don't know if you see. I, I show you very, uh, very fast. Okay, I take a very simple wire. Um, okay, I fix. Very quick, just for show you. You separate the wire. We use this technique for the anti bouquet or for the bridal bouquet also. And when you start, you start like this. And in the middle, after you obtain a, a, like a small flower. I don't know if you uh, if you ever see this technique. I think I make very fast. Huh? It's not uh, very very perfect. Just for for you remember. Of course, I continue. So I don't know if you see correctly. Yes. So this one, it is always a twist technique. Okay. For hantai or bridal bouquet. Number three and number four, um, I can explain today because for me it is a new um, twist technique. I um, check this solution in January, uh, but I think it's very interesting technique also. I teach uh, yesterday this technique. So for this one, it is uh, uh, like a chicken wire, but asymmetrical. After, for obtaining this texture, I use a clay. 
but I fix the clay with the wood glue. Um, I don't know if you remember, but always I work the clay because I love this material, this mineral uh, material, because after when it's dry, sometimes you e e um, crack, yes, it's crack, and, uh, um, and sometimes, like this, uh, we have uh, um, a, a texture like coral in a sea, okay? And uh, uh, when you connect everything after, it's very, very, very strong. Um, in the middle, uh, I fix a vine and branch for obtain a very small uh, uh, space, empty space for self. Oh my God, I don't remember self supporting. Ah, self supporting the the, the flower. And after, when we, when I show you, I crisscross my uh, all the stems. So I show you also like this. Maybe it's better. And like this also. Yes, for me it's very very uh, interesting texture. It's very light, and you can see it's so strong. Yeah. So and you can see also, I fix uh, four uh, feet, just for elevate a little bit my design, for see the stems. Because when the stems crisscross, for me it is always aesthetic. And I use for this um, design, again, a plate. Yes, Angelica, you have maybe a question. So the not hard question, no, please. No, it's not hard. I just want confirmation. <laughs> so the clay and the wood glue together make it not only strong, but also flexible, right? Because the construction is pretty flexible? Absolutely no. It's not uh, uh, flexible. It's uh, very uh, hard very very strong okay. because if uh, the structure is uh, uh, soft very flexible uh, the clay out ah, okay. yes. and i explain yes you use uh, the uh, wood glue it's a uh, um, very very good solution the wood glue it is uh, for me the the best glue you can uh, uh, use the wood glue for um, for every material, everything, plastic, uh, uh, mineral material, dry material, glass also. Yes. I uh, fix uh, a, a paper in a glass uh, sometime with a wood glue. And uh, also the other advantage with uh, uh, wood glue, uh, it is when the wood glue is dry, she's uh, transparent. Okay, I start. This material, it is a rhododendron. Amazing flower. We use, of course, only uh, in the spring. 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 Yeah. And after I have a lot of uh, flower from margin par. Um, a wonderful scabiosa, but no, no, no. Everything is wonderful with margin par. The scabiosa, the talinum, the clematis, of course. The solidago, craspedia, so big. The steam so strong. Very good quality. I really like this company. I am not ambassador, huh? but no, I really like this company because we have uh, many, many things, many variety. Um, 
and yes, the quality is very, very good. And a lot of choice. Oh my God, it's so beautiful. Of course, I, um, I uh, use again the decorative uh, style, but this one, it is a little bit uh, garden style. It's different expression. This time it's uh, a little bit a uh, trend, tendance, trend, trend, yeah. And for the garden style, we need a lot of level. This uh, style, this expression is different. This expression, we need to uh, um, invite the customer in the design for a little bit travel. You understand? Yeah. Every time you look at it, you see a new, new something. Sorry, Angelica? Every time you look at the arrangement, you see something new. Oh, yeah. yeah. Mm, it's better. So, Frédéric. Yes. A question from Taiwan. Yeah. May I know how many days you need to finish this frame, this construction? <laughs> I know on sure because I think after you are halfway. No, I, uh, I make uh, this uh, um, structure, um, I, no, I uh, make, I, um, I use only one day for uh, this uh, structure, yes, because it's very big, of course. But uh, uh, sometimes I uh, uh, make very small shape like this, and after it's very short. Um, I explained just before, I use this design for demonstration in uh, Germany for the trade show in uh, SN, but I need uh, very big uh, pieces. But you can use this, uh, this ID for a small bouquet or for the small bridal bouquet or for the small composition. Huh? Okay, when I uh, start, uh, always I start, I start with a big flower, large, or with a strong flower. And after I use a medium flower and I finish with a small flower. Never um, take uh, two like this and two like this and after we start with like this. No, absolutely no. Uh, after is not uh, the proportion, the balance, the harmony is not good. Also, I use uh, a wonderful tulip. Mm, yeah, yeah. Papa Ver, look amazing. And for flooring, it's so easy because uh, the, the vine helped me a lot.
He's finished his time. I don't want suffer. Suffer? Suffer, suffer yeah. <laughs> when I walk. I want enjoy. It's the most important. And I discover when I know so far, uh, I give a lot of emotion in the design. It's very different. I don't know if you um, if you uh, see um, uh, in a top, Mike. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Sorry, I have to come a little bit. Sorry for that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No problem. Look also this amazing tulip. Of course, I am in the Zealand. Huh? I don't know the variety. Huh? No, ask me. Because I, I show before in a, in a paper, but uh, the grower no right the variety. The tulip is interesting in this style because uh, uh, you know the tulip, uh, when uh, we cut uh, uh, the tulip, uh, she uh, continues grow her in the water. And sometimes she destroys a little bit the design, the shape. For this one, it's very interesting because she continues uh, a grower, growing. She um, no transform the shape because it is a garden style and we have uh, extremely uh, different level. The color uh, is very solar, yeah. Sorry? Vibrant, Vibrant. yeah. Exactly. But I have a, a analogous um, combination. Huh? Color combination. This flower is uh, Bill Bergia. From my garden, of course. <laughs> <laughs> mm. 
very poetic flower also. Because the shape for me connected very well uh, the structure and uh, the design. Okay, I use finally the amazing Scabiosa from Manji Park. When these Scabiosa open, they are so, so big, like a ranunculus. I love that. So feminine. So romantic. Like me. We have a lot, a lot of color also. Yeah. But yesterday also we have a walk, a many uh, flower uh, from Mountain Park. Um, a very nice erangium also, little bit gray, gray color, not blue. So interesting color and texture when you connect uh, the, this erangium with uh, maybe the lichen or moss, natural moss. Look, no word. No necessary, just enjoy. The nature is, she is very perfect. Huh? Only the human, it is a mistake for me. And I explain all, always uh, my job, it is, uh, I, am, I am not florist, I am not designer for me, I am a um, 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 messenger, no, um, uh, messenger of the nature, yeah. yes. for the customer and the people can um, see the reality. The nature is uh, so, so important for everyone. Also a new flower from Margin Park, Salvia. Also very interesting color and texture. Yesterday I wore a salvia, a blue salvia, and today it is a purple salvia. Purple, it's always a good combination with uh, orange, coral color.
we have in the chat uh, Dang from Korea saying, I like your ideas of work. Thank you so much. Me too, I like. <laughs> In Garda style, we need a lot of variety. Like uh, English garden. A little bit climatis also. But you can see, huh? I start with the big flower and after the medium, now the fin, and after I finish with the uh, extra fin, yeah, with the talinum. And when after you, if you use this theory and this technique, after uh, when you have finished your design, you see everything, every flower. Because sometimes, no, sometimes, often, I um, I see um, the student use a small flower and after the big flower. But it's like uh, a picture in uh, in uh, for the with the children uh, in a classroom. Uh, you put the small children in the back, in the in the top, and after in the back the tall children. It's the same. I have experience with the size. A little bit traumatism. So we are changing the card of the camera. We will be right back soon. There is still uh, sound, so uh, Frederic can still talk to you, but uh, <laughs> it takes a few seconds. But the people see me? Um, later. Ah, OK. Oh, now I stop. Now they, can now they can see you again. I can continue. OK. Good night. You can go to in a restroom. <laughs> ah no, it's finished. <laughs> so fast. No time for uh, to drink. Okay. Or take a cake. I don't know if you see, no, you, you, I think you know see the um, real reality, but uh, the um, first feeling, uh, I think you uh, see it's very compact, but in real, it's very transparent. I see inside the light in the back here. But for you, it is a little bit black, but in real, I have a lot of light inside. Of course, always uh, uh, the emotion and the real reality no pass in the television. Uh. Okay, I finish with the uh, talinum. Again, we from margin part. Yes, look, it's very thin, very thin flower. A little bit, uh, little bit pink, yellow, and orange. Yeah. 
is perfect with this color. Yes, I have a make a white shirt for you can see uh, correctly the color, the subtility. It's a good idea, no? Yes, very oh, good. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I am so clever. You only have good ideas, <laughs> Peter. <laughs> I compliment myself. Yes, I stop my uh, explication and uh, talk. Just enjoy the color, the effect. Me too, I enjoy the work. Well, then I am going to say something. Uh, we have, uh, it's uh, Christina from Hungary in the chat saying, mm -hmm. Frederic, you are amazing i wish i was able to go to your class hopefully next time do you have online courses welcome you can come i love to share my uh, experience my personal theory It's very important for me uh, to share because uh, we need, um, um, ah, I don't know in English, we need to um, um, take uh, uh, every florist in, uh, in the top for elevate my job. You understand? Yes? Really? Okay. My philosophy. I connect a little bit Muellen Bekia in the top because I use the Muellen Bekia when I start. I see uh, inside this Muellen Bekia, but uh, I explain always. Uh, when you have a material in the back, we need this material in the top. Like uh, uh, French cake, the name is millefeuille. I don't know in English, but I think you understand. You have uh, uh, like bread, cream, bread, cream, okay? Yes, it's uh, um, very important. Uh, uh, use this um, effect, uh, this feeling, because after you have, when you have finished, you have a good connection, um, good osmosis everywhere. So, of course, we need the water in container. And I elevate a little bit, you can see no sink move because all the steam crisscross the vine uh, self supporting oh, mike look finally the self supporting all the flower and in the top the flowering the flower dancing like a garden you see correctly, uh, I think now. 
It is like a bouquet, anti-bouquet, but no. So I hope you like, maybe you love. I love. <laughs> I think everyone loves because it was very quiet in the chat. So okay. Taiwan says very fruitful and lovely design. Yes, the color is colorful, like a little bit uh, candy color. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. And for um, introduce uh, the uh, sprite, is for me is good. It's good. Okay. So I move the design. And uh, I show you the last uh, uh, pieces because we need to move the table, everything, cleaning. You can go in a restroom, you have a time. Yes, because uh, uh, the last pieces is a little bit high. can make a little bit kiku together. Huh? Okay. Hey. Angelica. I'm concentrating. Yeah, yes, I see, <laughs> I see. <laughs> I see. Uh, I don't know if uh, we see everything. No, huh? Yes. Okay, I move this one. My God, a lot of transformation. Or maybe a little bit uh, height. Oh, after in the back it is um, it is a fit, and it's not very important to see. So I explain um, the this one, the last one. Um, it is uh, a new uh, shape, new direction for the displacement because uh, uh, Gregor or um, Niku or Daniel Santamaria, Bart Assam also explain uh, uh, also the displacement. Uh, we have uh, uh, the container or the glass here and always we have uh, sometime in the right or in the left, uh, you design. And we need to connect uh, with a line or with one flower, the glass you support with uh, uh, your flowering. For this one, it's uh, very different, the shape, um, uh, a little bit close. Um, the 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 fit, you know, I have this shape, this direction. And I have the empty space in a contour in my uh, fit. This fit, uh, it is uh, 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 my fabrication, of course. Um, I use a cement, it's a little bit heavy. But uh, it's very stable. Yeah, you have a very good uh, stability, and uh, um, it's like a clay. I really like this texture, the mineral texture, because we have always a very good connection when you use a rustic texture, like a branch with a lichen, like this. Of course, we have a good connection with the color, but I have again a good connection with the texture. I have again a good connection with uh, um, dry material and uh, uh, with uh, moss 
because uh, a mineral texture uh, connected, uh, we have a good weighting uh, with many, many textures. So, um, for uh, make this part, I use, uh, I don't know in English, sorry, uh, Mike or Angelica help me. No, you, because you don't have a hair. Uh, uh, Angelica, when you brush your hair, you have, uh, uh, I don't know the name, it's not a brush, comb. it's flat. Yeah, comb. Comb? C? Yeah, comb. C? O -M -B. O -M -B. okay, comb. It is a comb technique, okay, with a wire, black wire again. Um, I use, of course, uh, uh, for the skeleton, uh, a very, very strong wire, and uh, I twist a lot. And after I have, uh, I maybe uh, show you if I take out a little bit snake grass, if you can uh, film. Okay, this part, it's okay for you, or maybe with my white shirt. Is better? Mm -hmm. Yeah, no me, huh? this part. Huh? <laughs> um, I don't remember. Comb? Comb technique, you know. Sometimes we can fix uh, uh, a pearl or berries or, uh, or free like this because it's always interesting because you repeat, repeat, repeat the same uh, direction or the same uh, effect the same feeling. Or for this example, you can fix the snake grass. After the snake grass is fresh now, but uh, it can dry, it's not a problem because for me, we have a good texture always with uh, uh, a vase. Um, between you can see I uh, put a, a, a plant, elixin plant or moss, natural moss, and I fix my tube also between the, um, the snake grass. So, when I uh, flowering, I, uh, for this one, I use a lot of plant. Because for me, the plant, uh, um, we no use a lot, uh, yes, we, we sell a plant in a shop, but uh, we no use the plant for a very interesting design. Always we use a flower and we can make and mix also uh, um, a plant with flower. For me, it is a future. And the COVID accelerate uh, this uh, um, effect because many people want a garden now or want uh, a plant in a small terrace or balcon or in house, green plant. For the displacement, uh, um, we use uh, the principal theory again for the good balance and the good um, visual uh, feeling. We use the golden rule. It's the best uh, solution for obtain the good proportion. And uh, I no need a lot of uh, uh, fresh material. When the design, it's, uh, the concept, it's, and the line is interesting, 
We no need the flowering everywhere. Just a little bit signature. It's enough. I use this Protea first. Also, is a good connection uh, color connection and texture um, connection. White or gray, a little bit gray with my uh, vase and black because I have a lot of black with the snake grass and uh, uh, with of course uh, black wire. Very good harmony. The roots with the orchid also is a good connection with the lichen and again with the cement. You can see also my first uh, golden rule. My principal point, the second. 853 and I connect after with the Kala Lily everything and also for me the Kala Lily repeat with the round line the round shape with uh, this uh, structure you know I use a tube, of course, but I cover the tube with uh, 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 the band wire because the uh, uh, tube, the glass tube or the plastic tube, it is other te texture. And uh, it's very important. Uh, 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 we can mix a lot of texture in uh, one design. Maximum, we can use five different textures. It's totally different with the color. No question today? No. Just enjoy or you sleep? Yes. Maybe you sleep. When the work it's a little bit nervous, because I have a lot of line, we need the calm material for obtain a visual uh, point. Also, it is a good uh, color combination with a Hercara leaf and with a Protea. So Taiwan says, really enjoy the curving lines of the design. Thank you, thank you. Okay, epiphilum. 
also very interesting material. Epiphyllum Gullinger for the variety. Also this one, because I need um, a passive materials for connect the back with the top and always this shape like a calla lily or like the um, in the top of my um, structure and the support like this. I prepared just before also um, fake uh, steams. Mm -hmm. Yes, fake steams. Just uh, for uh, give more life for my um, Tilantia xerographica. Because if you uh, put the Tilantia inside, you don't have a life. But like this is very interesting. Of course, the color and the texture is a good combination. And uh, uh, you can move the stems because I fabric the stem with the wire. And after it's easy because if you want to move the tilandia, you can give a, a different way. I like when it's very strong. I fix a lot. There is a question from Anmela Hindocha. Yeah. How is the Tilantia wired? Sorry, can you repeat, please? How is the Tilantia wired? Wired? Wired. Ah, it is a black wire. You stick it in the tilantia? Yes. It is this wire. Yep. Yeah. For everything, eh? for all the design, I use this black wire. Because it's very, very strong wire. The size, it is 1.8. You know. Um, I cover um, two, three stem, stems 
uh, with a floral tape and after I cover with a, a band wire. But inside also, uh, it is this one, but a different uh, longer, it is one meter. Because this one, I don't know, it is, uh, oh, yes, uh, uh, six, five, five, uh, 15 or 16 centimeter. Yes, yes, maybe 50 probably, yeah. And uh, you have one meter like this. Here, this part, I use also this one. For this one, no. Uh, this one, I use the uh, stems, uh, uh, no stems, um, rod, 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 rod uh, uh, metal, because I need very, very strong um, metal because this part supporting everything. The effect, it is like uh, a suspending garden. Uh. And uh, yes, the Tillandsia always, oh, not always, but often, um, I use the Tillandsia like this for obtain more uh, life. And I use also this technique for the uh, succulent plant, like uh, Echeveria or like uh, Hyonium, something like this. Yes. I think it's not bad. I um, put the Ripsalis and uh, uh, the Senecio in a tube, but sometimes it's not necessary eh? because this plant uh, can uh, uh, survive with no water. Okay. Maybe. I uh, use this one for you see correctly. I don't know if I can make alone. Yes, maybe. Please me. Okay. No, it's okay. I, I take it just for turn for you see correctly. Because. Uh, uh, I don't have one face. When you turn the design, you are different uh, story. For me, it's very important when you make uh, um, a, a strong uh, um, design. It's more natural. And uh, uh, you invite everyone to um, travel uh, because we have always uh, a surprise when you uh, um, push, no push, uh, when you, uh, no, when you turn, when you um, look. Yes, uh, it's not. Uh, the world, but I think you understand. So, I hope you uh, you learn during this live stream. I hope you enjoy also. So I take out <coughs> now. You can help me. Thank you. Yes, I hope you have learned. Do you have again a question, maybe?
just uh, before uh, goodbye, yes. Anela Hendocha says, stunning design and very clever done. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. <laughs> and this is good uh, for me, uh, for hand, white and white. It is always a white color, it's always perfect color. No, color. The white color, it is not color officially, yeah. You don't have a white uh, in a chromatic uh, circle or in rainbow. It is a, yes, for finish, for hand, it is live stream. You can see uh, I work the white color alone. Of course, with the green color. You can mix the white color with only one other color. For example, red and white, or blue and white, or pink and white, yellow and white. You never, never mixed a lot of color and after you use a white. Absolutely no, it is a mistake, it's wrong. Because when you take a picture or when you see the uh, white uh, flower uh, give you a hole, hole, yeah. Uh, so yes, you can use the white alone or with only um, two color or um, very, very small white flower with uh, um, pastel color, very light uh, yellow, very light uh, uh, pink. It's okay, again, but uh, not with uh, every color. So, I hope you enjoy a lot. I wish you uh, good, have a good day, a good afternoon or good night. To depend uh, where uh, you are here, and uh, see you next time for uh, next live stream. If uh, Jacqueline and Mike invite me again, I am not sure. Of course, we would <laughs> love to invite you again. Maybe later this year would be lovely. Yeah. <laughs> yes. No. Thank you. It's thank always you. good hospitality. The students. It's always. Uh, very concentrated. It's always perfect here. Thank you very much. Good, uh, good uh, school. Thank, thank you, you thank you so much. so much for everything. And uh, see you next time. Yes. Yeah. So bye bye. Thank you. What is it? For you to say thank you for oh, everything. thank you, <laughs> thank you. It is alcohol. Yes, okay. Of <laughs> so of course. <laughs> I, I know drink a lot, huh? <laughs> thank it's, you. It's for for like trips and stuff. It's difficult that. Oh. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so <laughs> much. And it's a good combination for hand. Look, <laughs> black, white, green. Okay, I take out the knife, it's yellow. <laughs> so, thank you so much, and bye bye, and see you next time. Yes, thank you very much. So, for everyone who is watching, if you like this video, I'll just say all the standard things. Please. Hit the thumbs up button, hit the like button if you enjoyed it, it would help us a lot. If you want to see more videos like this, um, we do live streams every other week with demonstrations. Every time, different person, sometimes it's me, sometimes it's my mother, this time it's the amazing Frédéric. Um, subscribe. If you subscribe to the channel, you will see whenever the new videos come out. So that's very useful. And hit the little bell button. There's also a bell button there. Yes, you have to do all these things. So. Thank you very much, everyone. Hope you enjoyed and see you next time.